What's up, everybody? If you're seeing this, then that means it is Kobe Bryant Day on 403 Sports Talk. Today is episode 424, August 24, 2022. Uh, hence, Kobe Bryant Day, 824. You understand. Um, good to have you. Um, hope all is well with you and yours. Kobe Bryant Day on 403 Sports Talk. Uh, as you know, I think he's the best basketball, best player to ever touch a basketball. Uh, 20 ring, 20 seasons, 5 rings, including a 3-peat, 2000, 2001, 2002, 2002, and ranks 4th all-time in scoring in both regular and postseason play. Uh, that's a lot of games. Which one was my favorite, you ask? Uh, game 7 at home versus the Celtics. Uh, the Celtics played great defense early on, keeping Kobe Bryant quiet in the first quarter and relatively all game. Uh, it was a hard-fought contest, um, with my Lakers winning 83-79, our 16th NBA title. Kobe shot terribly, 6-24 of 24 from the field, 23 points, 15 rebounds, 2 assists, and a steal. Hardly not what we know him for, but his uh, prowess as a premier defender um, definitely showed. His toughness, the grit, the tenacity, all of that. Uh, Boston's strategy on dealing with him was clear from the get-go. Uh, to be aggressive and get in his face on every single possession, whether he has the ball or not. Um, and it kind of worked if 23 points is what you consider good enough or not walking away with a NBA championship for your team, then hey, whatever. Uh, the goal there for Doc Rivers and his team was to bring that banner back to Boston, of which they failed miserably. Lakers 83, Boston Celtics 79. That's it. It's my favorite Kobe game. Not the 81 points against Toronto, which was very magnificent. Um, or when he went on that streak of 30 plus point uh, per game. We went on a tear a couple times in his career. Um, and I said he led the league in scoring twice, too. One of the times in which I was describing. Anyway, that's it. Kobe, hope your um, career and your life um, is, is an honor. Um, thank you for entertaining me as long as you did. And, um, I don't miss you, man. Definitely not. <sighs> anyway, MLB. Um, double header for the Cubs and the Cardinals. Cubs won the first one to zip. Uh, St. Louis wins the second one, 13 to 3. Um, Atlanta Hawks, Braves, 6. Pittsburgh Pirates, 1. Baltimore, 5. Chicago White Sox, 3. Um, Philly, 7. Cincinnati, 5. New York Yankees beat the Mets, 4 to 2. Same score they did. Like about a month ago. Wow. Tampa Bay 11, Los Angeles Angels 1, San Francisco 3, Detroit 1, Toronto 9, Boston 3, Arizona 7, Kansas City 3, Houston 4, Minnesota 2, Colorado 7, Texas 6, Cleveland 3, San Diego 1, Miami 5, Oakland 3, uh, Los Angeles Dodgers 10, Milwaukee Brewers 1, and the Seattle Mariners over the Washington Nets 4 2. That's it for MLB. Let's talk WNBA playoffs. Chicago Sky, 90. New York Liberty, 72. Chicago wins the series. Two games, 2-1. Two, Copper, Quigley, and Parker. Uh, sounds like a law firm, right? Um, it's the three-headed beast that are the WNBA Chicago Sky. These are the same three women who went to work a few days prior in order to win a big game and swing the momentum back in their favor. Um, with a series tying victory. They did it here again last night. The opposition didn't suffer nearly the same shooting woes as they did uh, the game before, but they were clearly outmatched from the start. Candace Parker was a few decisions away from another triple-double, um, but she settled with 14 points, 13 boards, and 8 assists. Allie Quigley also finished with 15 points, 4 rebounds, and assists. And she was magic from the field and beyond the arc, shooting over 50% at both. Uh, Courtney Vandersloot chimed in with 14 points, 5 rebounds, 10 assists. Kalia Copper finished with 15 points, 2 rebounds, 2 assists, and 2 steals. And off the bench, my homegirl, Zora Stevens, dropped 12 points, 8 boards, and a steal. Doing the dirty work that was necessary for that victory. Uh, Sabrina Ionescu had 15 points, but struggled shooting the ball as well as the rest of her team. They collectively went a dismal 7 for 22 from 3 and shot well on the floor at 43.5%. It wasn't enough. Chicago Sky 90 and New York Liberty 72. Final Chicago advances, and that is the end of episode 424. Um, we love you all. Wish you nothing but health, wealth, and success. And we thank you for your continued support of Forum Sports Talk. We'll see you tomorrow with episode uh, 425 of 403 Sports Talk. Have a good night.